What's up guys, I finally got a 3D printer and I'm super excited about this new way of making things. It's an Anycubic i3 Mega S and what I really like about it is the fact that it's got two motors for the z-axis. Apart from that, it's pretty similar to other entry-level models and in this video I'm going to set it up for the first print. Let's open the box and dive right in. There's a power cable and we've got some filament for the first prints, a spatula to get them off the print bed, a filament holder which we are going to mount later, a USB stick with a pre-installed print file, a USB cable to connect it to the computer, an SD card and a second heating element. Finally there's a cutter, some screws and a warranty card. The printer itself comes in two main pieces, the base and the U-frame that goes on top. Now that we got everything together, it's time for assembly. Let's cue the music. Wow, that was trippy, but look at the results. The owls turned out to be pretty good with proper print bed adhesion and nice details. I'm quite impressed by the quality of the print right out of the box, so that's a big plus for this printer. The only downside is that for my taste, you can see the separate layers a bit too much, but I guess that's just part of 3D printing. Anyway, if you know how I can improve the prints, please leave a comment below. I'm new to this hobby, so I'm happy about any tips you might have. For now, I'll hop over to Thingiverse and get some new ideas on what I might print next. If you're into 3D printing, check out my first print with liquid resin that I used to fix my window shades or take a look at the 3D printing playlist right here where I'll add more videos in the future. See you in the next one. Bye!